Let's move over to the personality menu. Here you can create a title for yourself. Example of how it will be displayed on screen right now. You may also customize your sigil. Sigils may be unlocked during the course of the game or you can also purchase the hunt pass for a unique sigil for that season. Different dyes can be applied to sigils and banners. Banners are also customizable, different shapes can be chosen, styles may be purchased through the in-game store, unique styles for that season can be acquired through the hunt pass. Other styles can be unlocked during the progress of the game. Flag staff options are also available. A flag staff is the pole that holds your banner. Creation Let's have a look at the emotes that you can equip The classic thumbs up Ain't no way that's gonna happen I got you man Awesome stuff with emotes, making things a lot more fun. What exactly are flares? Flares are used to mark a location for all players. For example, if a behemoth has been found, it will also show a flag on your compass to indicate where the flare has gone off. Flares also appear in different colors. You're looking at blue, green, orange, red and yellow. One of my favorite features in the game, Hunt Arrival. These are the emotes that can be equipped just before the hunt begins. Emotes are played just after you fall from the air transport. These are awesome stuff and quite fun to have equipped. Various emotes to choose from. I'm sure you'll find the right one to match your playstyle and personality. Let's have a look at the various ones currently on offer. And next up, Slayer Appearance. You guessed it, this is where you customize your character. And to be honest, we could be in here for days, so let's not. <laughs> 